let's start by saying this show will definitely get a season two. If it doesn't, I'll be flabbergasted. Now, as I've mentioned in previous videos, um, Fallout the game for me is my sleep movie. It's like the movie you get that you fall asleep, you just can't help yourself but fall asleep to. Fallout for me, I've tried so many times, I just cannot play that game. Fallout 3, Fallout 4, even 76, I haven't got a chance. Um, I, I just can't play them. Now, let's get one thing straight. Fallout is not a bad game. That's not what I'm saying. It's, it just doesn't work for me. It just doesn't do it for me. And there's a mistake people make when people say something's bad. Um, or something... There's a difference between bad and not for you. You know what I mean? I know Fallout's a game and I understand why people love it. I just can't get into it. I've tried many times. So, going into this TV series, I was hoping it would lift my... Um, lift my energy towards the game kind of thing if you know what I'm saying and it has it has I will probably install Fallout again and try once more to play the game but getting back to this uh, TV series it's great it is really good from start to finish each episode is an over an hour long which is brilliant well an hour long, um, I'd say five minutes of credits, but uh, each episode's an hour long. Absolutely fantastic. They've made an absolutely wonderful world. Now, because I've never actually played Fallout all the way through and such forth, um, I'm not too known, you know, like all the Easter eggs have thrown in there, which I'm sure there are many. Um, I'm not too TV with them all, but um, even without that, it's fantastic. It's violent. It's gory. Um, the the story I kind of already know the as I say I, the general gist of what Fallout is, so I don't have to explain that to most people who've watched Fallout anyway. Uh, who've played Fallout anyway, they kind of get the gist of what Fallout's about. It's just about the vault, vault dwellers up on the surface trying to find the way. I know there's been a bit of um, chat back and forth on Twitter and such forth about Brotherhood of Steel being in it and whatnot, but I don't, I don't under, I don't get all the the um, the law, so. I can only go off what I've seen on the screen. And what I've seen on the screen is absolutely fantastic. From the very beginning, the first episode gets you hooked immediately. Uh, and then each episode after, there's not a boring moment in any of them. Every shot is made to do something, whether it be a nostalgic view of the old vaults or the twists going on near the end it's all really really good now I'm not a full reviewer you know I'm not a proper reviewer so I can't give you big words and all that kind of stuff and pretend that I know stuff that I don't all I can tell you is what I've seen and it goes like this beautifully shot absolutely gorgeous it's in 4k and it's just absolutely stunning not a penny has been misspent i can tell you that much not a penny has gone to waste on this series uh the characters in it are absolutely um trying to think if there's any bad character there's a few bad characters in in, in the vault that were a bit annoying um but by that characters have actors are fantastic um the young lady that plays the actual vault dweller is so, just it just comes across so it, like innocent it's funny 
Um, everything about it, the set, the sets, everything about it is just absolutely brilliant. I was going to give five, but I don't need to. I can only say that it's a really good show. I've seen some good shows in in, in the past. It, you know what? You know what annoys me about this is that Prime have done this, and then you got Paramount doing Halo, and they have literally. I will not watch the Halo. I watched two. I think it was two episodes of Halo, and I get it straight immediately because you know if you played that the Halo game, you're like, no, 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 no. Whereas Fallout, I've only played a little bit of Fallout, and I understand what's going on in the kind of what's going on. And I absolutely loved it. So, this is just my opinion, but I'd give it a go because you probably really will enjoy it. And this is even if you're not into fall, even if you're not into the game Fallout, because as I said, I certainly am not. I've tried Fallout lots of times. Trust me, I've put my hours in, but just cannot get into that game whatsoever. Um, but that doesn't change the show. The show is absolutely worth watching. So, uh, thanks for watching. And I will see you in the next one.